Hey my loves, welcome to my channel. In today's video, get ready with me for this New Year's Eve, for which I have styled myself with this beautiful dress from Saki and paired it with some oxidized jewelry. But before that, subscribe to my channel and press the bell notification so that you never miss an update whenever I post a new video. For my makeup, I chose to keep it simple and minimal. So I directly started with a concealer and I'm applying it to the areas wherever I have uneven skin tone or I want to highlight. Before the concealer, I did some skin prep for which I applied some moisturizer and vitamin C face serum on it. Now blending the concealer using a wet beauty sponge. For the concealer, I'm using Elegal Pro Conceal in shade Porcelain. For second step, I quickly did my contour to give my face some definition. For the contour, I have used cream contour from Steakworky in shade dark brown. After that, I set my concealer using pressed powder from Faces Canada and I am in shade ivory. You always need to set your concealer using some loose powder or pressed powder to avoid creasing. Then I used a pink shade creme lipstick from Color Bar to apply as a blush. On top of it, I applied lip and cheek tint from My Glam in shade Falling. Then blended both together using my beauty sponge. Moving on to the highlighter, I have used Master Chrome Metallic Highlighter from Maybelline in shade Molten Gold and I am applying it to the areas wherever I want to highlight like my cheekbones, my brow bone, my chin, nose and cupid bone. This is my favorite highlighter for all the time because it gives a very natural glow to your face. Moving on to my eyes, now I am first filling my eyebrows and I am only filling the sparse area without moving out to the natural shape that I have. I have kept my eyes very simple. I am using today a Morphe Jaclyn Hill palette volume 2. I have taken the brown shade from the palette to create the crease and I am using a small blending brush to apply it over my crease which will give a little depth to my eyes. Then I took the light pink shade from the palette and applied it to my lid below the crease. Blending everything together to avoid sharp edges so that everything looks seamless. Then applying a very thin layer of eyeliner from Lotus Botanicals very close to my lash line. I am keeping it very simple without creating any wing. Doing the same with my other eye as well. Now above the black one, I am using pink eyeliner from My Glam to create that graphic effect. I would like to go slow here to make sure very neat line and shape is created in both the eyes. Then to finish the look, I took some pink eyeshadow from the palette and I applied it to only my outer V. Then curled my eyelashes and applied some coat of mascara. 
द मस्कारा दैट आई हैव यूज टूडे इज जो मैंड वुश मस्कारा फ्राम कलर बार यू मे हैव सीन मी यूजिंग दिस इन सो मेनी वीडियोज़ बिकॉज दिस इज़ माई फेवरेट इट गिव्स अ वेरी गुड वॉल्यूम एंड कर्ल टू योर आईज आई एम अप्लाइंग इट टू बाउथ अपर एंड लोअर लैशेज For lipstick, I have used Lakme 9 to 5 Liquid Lipstick in shade Nude Kashmir. I wish you all a very happy and prosperous New Year. May this year brings a lot of happiness in your lives. So here's the completed look, and I hope you all would like it. All the details about brand and product purchase link I'll be mentioning in the description box. So don't forget to check it. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. So that's it for today, guys. I love you all so much, and I'll see you with a brand new one. Till then, stay safe and stay healthy. Bye.